Lisa Durden is a political commentator and Black Lives Matter supporter. She joins us tonight. Lisa, thanks for coming on. Thank you. Good to see you again. You're doing well. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I was confused by this because I thought the whole point of Black Lives Matter, one of the points would be to speak out against singling people out on the basis of their race and punishing them for that. Because you can't control what your race is, and yet they seem to be doing that. Explain that to me. What I say to that is boo hoo hoo. You white people are angry because you couldn't use your white privilege card whoa, whoa, to get invited Lisa. to the Black Lives Matters all black Memorial Day celebration. Wow. Let me contextualize that for you. Memorial Day was created by the Memorial Day was created. First of all, I don't want you to contextualize. Right? Oh, I, I need to contextualize it because Memorial Day was created by well, hold on. You, black are, you're former slaves in on the basis of their race. Okay. to honor those individuals who are union soldiers who fought and died for our freedom so Black Lives Matter in that same vein decided to get together with black folks I'm not gonna let to you honor filibuster black folks past my to question. make sure that black on, folks were celebrated for being murdered I don't, I don't by racist shut this down. terrorists. I don't want to shut this if down, you're mad but at I will. That, okay. you just, I'm not mad at that. I'm not mad at that. I just have a really simple question for you. If you yeah, don't ready. like people ex excluding others on the basis of their race and a society we agree that that's bad i agree it's bad you agree it's bad then why are you doing it and why are you defending Listen, it now? white folks crack me up all of a sudden when we want to have question. one it's day for value. black folks to focus on ourselves but you've been having white day forever you don't say the words anymore because you know it's politically incorrect but you've had an all white oscars all these movies with Man. all white uh, well, actors Movie after movie Why after are you movie, perpetuating all it? white TV shows with with white cast over and over and over again. The Bachelorette, it took eleven seasons of a black Bachelorette. Okay. Are you serious? It's, it's hard to believe. I hope you're not speaking for anyone else. I hope there aren't a lot of people. Well, in this my name is Lisa Durden. I'm speaking for you. Lisa Durden. I just hope there aren't people watching who agree with you oh, because what watching. you're saying is so hostile and separatist and crazy. It's such a basic violation of what I thought we all agreed on, which is you don't attack people for things they can't control, namely it's not it's their race. It's not an attack. I'm stating the facts. People give weddings you, where okay. they exclude children. It doesn't mean they don't like children. They don't know if your kids are going to be monsters and those kids are going to be well behaved. No, so in no. that same vein, We're Black all... Lives Matter decided to have one day where they didn't want white folks who are going to be off the rails. They don't know if you're going to be the ones behaved on for them or the ones who are there against them. So you, let, me, one let, me ask, let, me ask you a, let me just ask you a quick question. Go right Do ahead. Do you think it's racist to exclude people on the basis of their skin color? I think it's racist when you've been excluding people for hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of years. Stop with your silly and lectures. Forced, I'm asking you a very simple question. And we're forced question. to come together collectively to celebrate ourselves because you guys won't. You are the larger society. Let's be real mean, here. You, you guys, I'm not talking, I'm talking about what I thought we all believed. Let me ask you this. Do you think it would be fair if white people did come to a Black Lives Matter celebration? They do to all have the them, time. When you look at Black Lives Matter. Do you use Matters, the same water? Marches, they do? And you see black lives men are coming together collectively for different uh, issues. You see people of all races. So we do accept them this particular day. They said, stay your asses out. We want to oh. celebrate today. Okay. We don't want anybody going against us today. And you can't celebrate if someone who doesn't look like you is around? Yes, you can, but you can you're also demented, say, I don't want actually. to do it. It's a personal you're choice. Sick. And what you're saying is disgusting. And if you were a Nazi, I would say oh. the same thing to you. Luckily, I'm not a because Nazi. Because what you're saying is indistinguishable from what they are saying, which is, I don't care your opinions, I don't care your views, your life experience, your intentions. All I care about is the way you look, something that you can't control. And on that basis alone, I'm judging you, and I'm hostile to you. That's the case you're making, and it's divided and wrong, and it's amazing that you didn't have to say that out loud, but it, I, well, I can't believe you're well, making the case Unfortunately, unfortunately, when you have a racist society like America, you force individuals to come together collectively to make sure that they have a voice. And that's this unfortunate is what that the racism has like. caused okay. people to come together let me, collectively. Let me ask you a question. Is there a single white person in America no, you would have let into this now into I, the celebration. I, I'm not. I'm not Black Lives Matter. Black Lives Matter is a You're movement. You're just an apologist. However, 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 I can respect the decision. It doesn't mean it's a decision I would have made. Maybe I would have. Just like a wedding, where I might say your kids can't bring their badasses in okay. my wedding. Children are not an ethnic group. 
Every it doesn't person matter. You're discriminating world, against people with kids. You're saying don't bring your badass kids. W- would it be okay? Yeah, but you see, and it's not, okay. Okay, but w- there are white adults and Asian adults and Hispanic adults, and presumably they're basically the same as black we adults. Have, we but you we, don't agree we with have that. gay pride parades. We have Puerto Rican Day parades. And we have all Puerto kinds Ricans of are parades and, and days are that honor individuals. We, we have we have Mother's Day. We have Father's and Day. Fathers are allowed Mother's to Day. Just take your that. mama out. I'm not not sure you're out. capable of having this conversation. So I'm going to end it now. Let me uh, ask you one last. Let I'm me ask sorry. you one last question, and be totally honest with me. Yes. That. Do the people in your world, your parents, your siblings, your kids, your friends, do they agree with you on this? My family respects my right to free speech. No, don't give me that dumb They don't answer. always I mean, do they agree, agree with what you but just they said. They do, do agree you know with one thing. I have the right to free said. speech. Whatever. No one's contesting I'll it. I'll see stop. you next time on your show. That. You'll be do inviting you know me on again. Do you people who agree with oh, you? Oh, Tucker, like, I'm going to see you again in less than a month. Ratings are going up. I don't even up. know what you're talking about. And I'm not I sure do. I'll see you again, Thanks for coming on tonight, Lisa.